Some people say it's very touristy, but no matter what you think about it, this is still Ireland's number one attraction. And as a tour guide, I strongly recommend coming to visit our pride and joy, Guinness Storehouse. Ireland. Entry to the Guinness Storehouse is an average of 16.50, but there's loads of great deals available. You can get family tickets, you can book online and get a discount. You can go on one of those open top, hop on, hop off buses and get discounts there as well. But 16.50, it's well worth it. It's a magical attraction, and of course, you get included a complimentary pint of Guinness. Hey, welcome to Guinness Storehouse. So this is the original lease that Arthur Guinness signed back in 1759. Arthur was a smart Irish man because the lease is for 9,000 years, and this is also the reason we celebrate Arthur's Day every year in September. So you can easily spend a full day in the Guinness Storehouse, so it's perfect material for a day tour. You can have brilliant Irish food, there's a great gift shop that you can learn to pour your own pint. You can learn all about the great marketing expertise of Guinness. Or you can just keep zooming up and down in this funky elevator getting cool head rushes all day before you go to the gravity bar. So we've just arrived in the Guinness gravity bar. It's probably the best viewpoint over all of Dublin. And by sheer coincidence, as luck would have it, a rainbow has just come out. So we finally got our Guinness ready to settle. I'm here with Rowena, who's from Queensland. It's her first, Queensland in Australia, her first visit to the Guinness Brewery. The Irish for cheers, Rowena, is Slancha. Cheers, mate. Cheers, mate. So one of the many great things about a visit to the Guinness Storehouse is that you can come into the Guinness Academy and learn how to pour your own pint. Uh, I worked as a barman in Donegal for a few years growing up and poured thousands of pints, but nobody ever taught me how to do it properly. So Carl, who's from County Monaghan, is going to show me how to do it right now. All right. Cool. 45 degrees, point for the golden harp. You only use this top here, it's oh, all okay. okay. And up as far as the Guinness writing. Yeah, straight Start tilt. Now off. Perfect, yeah. Now you can switch it off. So this is going to turn completely dark yeah. and then we continue pouring forward. Exactly. So Guinness is known as the black stuff. It's actually ruby red in colour. Okay. As you can see there, the light's hitting it. It's sort of a ruby red in colour. That's the roasted Good. barley that gives nice. it a lot of the colour and nice. the flavour. Push forward like the valley car, straight up. This is where... Oh, Good bang. stuff. And then the final step is we present it on our bar with our Guinness harp facing out on the name. So my Guinness is ready. Um, a, a very momentous moment for me because I can now put on my wall beside my degrees from Queen's University and the Irish Tour Guide Academy, one from the Guinness Academy. So congratulations, thank you very much. Proud moment. Proud moment.